What up, folks? Ray Thunderbeast. Um, I have a SIG MCX, an MCX pistol, 300 blackout, five and a half inch barrel. Right now, there is a Thunderbeast Magnus on it. We also have our 338 Gen 2 Ultra. I have the Q. I have the Otter Creek. We have a Nomad LT, Diligent Defense Enticer L, and the CGS Hyperion. Ammo is 220 grain subsonic stealth. Uh, we just ran this on the bolt gun. We figured it'd be cool to run it on a five and a half inch semi-auto. We will get uh, ear numbers and mil spec left. You're gonna call out mil spec left or you wanna call out ear? I'll call mil spec left. And you guys will see the ear numbers. Can I grab a round? No, there we go. Ready? Should be set it in. There we go. And uh, this has two gas settings. It's on the lower of the two, right? So it's on the lower of the two gas settings. Um, Magnus comes off. We will have to steal the flash hider out of here to put into the 338 can. So I will jump to the Q. This is a Thunder Chicken. So that was Q. We can uh, jump to the 338 since it's in here. So this is a 338 Gen 2 Ultra. It has a CB to BA adapter, and then I am using a flash hider as a direct thread insert. Ready? 
Gen 2 Ultra. This is the uh, Otta Creek PRL 30, I believe. PLR. I get the acronyms wrong all the time. Ready? And 118.4. That's Otta Creek. Uh, Dead Air, Nomad LT. A diligent defense and Tyson L tie. It's light. I don't know how much it weighs on the top of my head, but it feels good. Bella wanting to play ball. Okay, last one. 
Best Canada test, uh, CGS Hyperion, printed version. Magazine. Again, ammo is one uh, 220 step. Megan all the way? Yeah. Yeah. Ready. Yeah, fire the Wait. other one. Ready. just must be short stroking a tiny bit because uh, it did not lock back and that's probably why it missed that other round there you go um big 30 cal cans on the sig 300 blackout semi-auto um, i know you guys are really going to be interested in the ear numbers they will be posted <laughs>